Hey there, YouTube! Daryl back at you again for another episode of Daryl's Bait Tape. So we're back. We're back once again, folks. And it's another sunny fucking day in Montana. Like 60 degrees outside today. So hopefully wherever you're at, the weather's nice and gravy, however you'd like to have it. If you like snow, sun, rain, whatever, hopefully everything's going great, all right? But today's episode is going to be about some high-voltage e-liquid. And this is lights out, all right? And a couple things about high voltage, they have a couple different flavors that are like melatonin based. So basically you vape on them, it's sleepy time. Alright, um, I haven't really tried or messed with the melatonin based e-liquid. I just don't like the sounds of me falling asleep when I'm vaping. That just doesn't even sound good. So, but a little bit more about the lights out. It's a raspberry flavored chai. Alright. And I'm kind of a little skeptical. If you don't know what chai is, it's it's kind of in the mint family. So it's uh it's like a spiced mint. All right, so a raspberry flavored spiced mint. If I put it in the long term, uh, I don't know. I'm not really a chai fan. Um, but they sent it to me, so I'm definitely gonna do a review on it. I gotta give you guys my real opinion. So let me go ahead and take a sniff test real quick. Uh, and to me, ah. Uh, I don't even know. This shit is not going to be my flavor, all right? If you like chai, this is going to be some good shit for you. But for me, this stuff is skeptical. Just just thinking about raspberry chai doesn't sound good. And the smell of it, I can smell the chai with the raspberry. Ah, uh, I hope it vapes good. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive down to the table and take a look at this bottle. Alrighty, so we're looking at the bottle right now. You can just see it's a high voltage premium e-liquid lights out. You can see I got three nick right there. Over here on the side, it just has all the ingredients and the proper warnings right there, okay? And over here, it says charged on, so it was made 815. And yeah, 15 mil bottle. Got the dripper right here. Got a little child lock on it. Seems like it drips okay. Everything seems fine. So why don't we go ahead and take it back up top. We'll take a couple vapes on it, and I'll let you guys know how it rolls off the tongue. Alrighty, so we just got done taking a little close look at this bottle. And pretty standard e-liquid bottle. Just says high voltage on it, lights out, some warnings, some stuff like that. And, uh, I mean, to get back to it a little bit, I'm not really looking forward to trying this stuff. I mean... Chai does not sound good, does not sound good mixed with raspberries, all right? Um, I mean, they sent it to me, and I'm going to try it for you guys and give you the flavor profile. But I tell you now that, I don't know, I just I just know that I'm not going to like it, all right? So that just brings me to think that it's just not going to be good for me. Um, but I'm trying it for you guys. Realize that I'm just not a chai guy. So if you like chai, I'm not trying to talk bad on it. I'm just saying I'm probably not going to dig it. But I'm going to go ahead and take a bait now. i got to sit in the trusty velocity, my taste tester. And uh, let me go ahead and take a bait. Yeah. Very, very not so good. All right. That, ah, uh, man. I don't know, the raspberry with chai, it's it's like raspberry pepper. I mean, it's just, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Um, I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and take one more vape for you guys and see if I get a different pull this time, but I don't think the results are going to change. Yeah. Um, in my opinion, I don't like chai. This shit is, it, it's just, uh, it's just nasty. Um, but if you like chai... You like a pepper, spicy flavor. Um, this might be your stuff, but for me, it's just not my kind. The other high voltage e liquids that I've tried, um, they got like a pomegranate, uh, like dragon fruit or something like that. It is a really good shit. I mean, most of their stuff is good. Um, I haven't tried their melatonin based e liquid, um, uh, but this stuff's just not for me. I'm definitely going to be giving this away, um, to somebody else that'll vape on it because it's not going to be me. Um, uh, but, you can find any of the high voltage e liquid for about 30 mils. They're running about 22 bucks. So, I mean, run of the mill e liquid price. And like I said, if you guys have tried some other of the high voltage e liquid, maybe the melatonin based kind, make sure you hit me up in the comment section. Let me know what you thought. But, um, for this stuff, not my kind of vape. 
Um, but like I said, if you like chai, like raspberry, like a little spicy flavor, it might be your stuff, all right? So I'm going to have to close this out with one more vape of this shit, but that'll be all for me. So if you guys liked anything in today's video, make sure you give me a big fat thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, make sure you subscribe. But besides that, I want everybody to have a fantastic day. And just remember, vape on YouTube. And this last vape, this is only for you guys.